Hey guys, welcome back to Green Tea Garden. Uh, if you're new to my channel, guys, it's all about gardening on this channel. Awesome tips, guys. Please do subscribe, it's 100% free. And I always have a lot of videos coming up and great tips on this channel. If you already subscribed, welcome back, guys. Hope everybody's doing good, doing great. Uh, hanging out with my uh, pet pig pepper there. In this video, guys, I'm gonna show you and tell you how and when to harvest your butternut squash so guys butternut squash when you plant them from seed uh, they take about 50 they take about 50 to 55 days to harvest but most of the time nobody checks or count or write those stuff down because when you do have a lot of stuff in the garden it's hard to keep up with everything so the first step guys to know and tell you butternut squash is uh ready and ripe uh it's the color it has to be fully tan no green you don't want to see no green or anything like that fully tan color really really hard i mean i could literally punch this and nothing happened and another test guys is try to stick it try to stick your thumbnail or your fingernail in there and if it can't go in it's really hard it's good to go so this guys this one is ready another thing too guys uh butternut squash doesn't matter what this size once they're fully tan and uh, they're really really hard and you can't get them to poke like that uh, they're ready to go I have another smaller one here and you could tell there's no green or anything sorry about the sunlight guys I'll show you another better one uh, I do have one more hidden over there so guys so basically butternut squash uh, they run all over I have three plants in here and they produce a lot guys all right so as you guys could see here it's all tan color coming right up guys look at that and the next sign you could watch too if the if right of the tip right if is, is getting a little brown coming up it's another sign too when it's ripe and it's really hard so let me show you guys how to harvest it right now so you do want to get yourself a pruner knife or something when harvesting a butternut squash guys i'll cut right up i'll cut close to the point so you have like an inch left on the butternut squash and I, and guys another thing is you could see the leaves that comes up here it's already changing color and brown i think that's another sign of letting you know this guy is ready so come right here close do not want to cut or mess up your plants so a little tough to cut but it's nothing that this pruner cannot do so so uh, let me brush this out there's a little dirt going on at the bottom there so if you look right here it's all tan yellow there's like a tiny bit of little light green on the top, tiny little stripe there, that's nothing. This thing is massive. I'm gonna show you guys, look, you guys could hear. Solid, not even a dent or a scratch or anything. So guys, that's the perfect time when to pick or harvest your butternut squash. And I'm gonna go around and as you guys could see, I do have a bunch. So I'm gonna harvest all. And so guys, as I'm harvesting, I just wanted to show you. Oh, there's a bee right here, pollinated. Oh, sorry, but I wanted to show you guys like, if you see your butternut squash, like lighter green color right there, do not harvest it. It's not ready yet. Uh, it has to get more golden tan color. Even this one right here, I still wanted a little bit more tan. So it's gonna get a little bit more tan golden color. And um. I do have, look, if you watch right there, I do have more, guys. And I do have a bunch more. My garden is a lot of, a lot of mess. I have some melons, uh, watermelons, cantaloupe, stuff like that. Um, so I do have some smaller ones there are growing still. And as you guys watch right here, it's really, really hot. I picked a bunch of them right now. So these why I picked these guys and I didn't pick the rest because these are really like really really tan color and they're massive guys in the store in Long Island New York guys I'm telling you butternut squash like this are very expensive all right guys so it's my dog so I had to bring it under the pergola it's really really hot and I wanted to show you guys up close right here uh, my dog is really you want to take a bite all right let me cut it up and you'll take a bite guys as I'm saying as you could see the goal uh, tan color like and the bottom it's it's hard really hard fingernail can't go in so that's when definitely is the best time to harvest and pick your butternut squash so i did get a couple here and there's a bunch more growing and the best thing of growing uh, harvesting your butternut squash guys if you want uh, you slice it in half and on the bottom over here you're gonna get all your seed 
Uh, I, will, I will tell you guys right now, the first day that you pick this, uh, cut it half, cut one of them in half, and just take a spoon, take out all that seed. You could save those seeds for next year. And uh, this is delicious stuff, guys. And it's fun. It's so it's fun when you plant them and from seed, and you know you grow them, and they are definitely harvested. Like I'm super excited as I'm talking to you guys right now, and uh, it's amazing. All right, guys, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully this video was helpful, and if it was, guys, please give a thumbs up and also subscribe to Green Tea Garden.